Governor Parson said the test was developed by researchers at Washington University in St. Louis and was officially approved by the U.S. Food and Drug Administration. He says that this is a major development in testing technology. But look, this is a game changer. Missouri will soon offer a new type of coronavirus test with rapid results. And we will help us continue to increase testing volumes and improve turnaround time for test results. That test is considered more comfortable than a nasal test. And Governor Parson sees this also as a win for the state. You've also got Pfizer here in the state of Missouri that's working on a vaccine. This is a great deal for our state and the technology the healthcare system we have that we're going to be leading the nation in those two things. With schools back in session, Parsons says he spoke with all university presidents in the state and their plan for COVID. They have very good plans in place how they're going to deal with this. So this was no surprise that students were going to come in here and test positive. Parson also mentioned his feelings about the House passing his crime bill provisions. I think one Five out of six is a good day uh, when you're dealing with the legislators. We would have loved to have seen the juvenile situation uh, be able to get that done. That was very important to us. Parsons says lawmakers are going to have to find the funding for the new witness protection program. You know, we'll deal special sessions as we move forward. But one, I mean, the legislature is going to have a plan. If we're going to come back for legislation, we got to have a plan in place to have a special legislation to get it done. Now, Governor Parson did not know when the test would be available in Missouri or how long it would take to get those test results back. But he did say more information will be released soon. Reporting for our Missouri Capitol Bureau, I'm Emily Manley. And